Hello everyone, welcome to JSN RS Solution. Hope you are fine. Today we are going to learn how to download active fire data for the whole world in shapefile Google Earth KML and also in text file CSV. I hope you will like this informative video. First, uh, go to Google search box and just write for information for resource management system and you will get this link uh, after uh, clicking in this link you will get this interface and here you will find detailed information on uh, fire information for resource management system here uh, this forms uh, provides access with minimal delay to satellite imagery active fire hotspots and related products to identify the location extent and intensity of wildfire activity uh, um, and these tools and application provide the special data products and services to the support the broader fire management community and to inform the general public so after that you can uh, click active fire data and uh, you will uh, get this interface here you can see uh, there are two options uh, for downloading the data one is uh, modis and another one is uh, viirs and you will uh, get this data uh, in 24 hour or 48 or 7 days basis in shape file kml or uh, csv file here you can see the shape files you can download the data as shape files for the uh, all country in modis or birs and also in landsat 30 meter resolution You can download this data for all country and you can also uh, download this as google kml file as like before modis or landsat or several other formats and also in text files uh, which is in csv file format for all the country you can uh, uh, see here so uh, i will download uh, google kml file I will go for South Asia, uh, Southeast Asia, and 24 hour. You can see uh, it has been downloaded in Google KML file format. After clicking here, you can see the active fire uh, data for Southeast Asia. Uh, it is in 24 hours, so you can download it 24 uh, daily basis or uh, weekly basis. the active fire data you can see over here you can also download it in shape file format so i'm downloading for australia and new zealand and struct files shape file format you may uh, open arc map and you can add this shape file in arc map and you can uh, perform for the analysis in arcmap you can also check uh, attribute table the data details and also you can check by adding uh, base map anyway i hope you enjoyed this tutorial thank you for watching see you in the next tutorial till then stay safe and healthy